You've heard it before, the lessons on how to prepare your home for a potential storm. But there's one home in Fort Pierce that takes those lessons to a whole new level. People visit this residence to learn more about protecting their own homes and families from storms. Our storm team coverage continues tonight with News Channel 5's Ricky Klaus, who takes us to the Hurricane House as part of the largest news team on the Treasure Coast. It looks like a typical house on the outside, but inside, screwdriver in case you run out of electricity. UF Consumer Sciences agent Carla Linfesti is giving me a tour of what's called the Hurricane House. We just encourage people to have some type of shuttering system. The house on Picos Road in Fort Pierce is one of four centers of its kind throughout Florida. The University of Florida Extension faculty aims to teach people here how to enhance the wind resistance of their homes, and it's a good place to check out before stormproofing your house. Linfesti says making storm plans and following through is the most important part. Preparedness is the key to surviving a storm. Some lessons I learned today. Linfesti says all shutters that are Florida Building Code or Miami Dade approved have been missile tested. So they're all as secure as one another. It's just a matter of cost and a matter of uh, putting them up. She says make sure all the parts are there and the panels are numbered and allow enough time to put them up ahead of a storm. Linfesti says if you wouldn't feel safe in your house during a Category 1 hurricane, you want to take shelter elsewhere. If you're in a mobile home or a really old home, um, and it didn't weather well before, you know, you don't want to stay there. She says deciding where you're going to hunker down ahead of time is crucial. One option the Hurricane House features protects against both hurricanes and tornadoes. I'm in the safe room at the Hurricane House. This room is made out of a quarter inch of steel, and it's stocked with items like headlamps and flashlights and food. Linfesti recommends keeping a go-to box with important tools and making three plans for before, after, and during the storm. In Fort Pierce, Ricky Klaus, WPTV News Channel.